नमस्कार दोस्तों वेलकम टू वीनस एस्ट्रो वीनस एस्ट्रो में आपका स्वागत है होप यू गाइज आर डूइंग गुड येस्ट डे वी लर्न अबाउट एथ लॉर्ड इन टू फर्स्ट सेकेंड एंड थर्ड हाउस आई एम अगेन रिक्वेस्टिंग पीपल दोज आर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो फर्स्ट टाइम गो एंड वॉच द वीडियो ऑफ एथ लॉर्ड एट हाउस एंड एट लॉर्ड दैट्स अ फर्स्ट वीडियो टू डेज बैक वी रिलीज इट वॉच दैट वीडियो कम बैक एंड देन वॉच दिस इन टू डिफरेंट हाउसेज दोज हुआ न्यू टू दिस चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब दिस चैनल एंड लाइक द वीडियो सो दैट इट गोज टू द अदर पीपल एंड दे गेट बेनिफिटेड uh today we are going to learn about eighth lord into fourth fifth and sixth important one fourth is house of happiness fifth is puru punya and sixth is prarabdha as we say but the sustenance of the puru punya let's get into our slide eighth lord into fourth house this is 4 8 and 12 this is the moksha trine but fourth house is also heart ketu in the background capable of blocking it so there is a risk heart disease heart attack and all those things this is also your property and all those things vehicle mother nurture research is there when i'm i'm saying i'm just recollecting everything oh my god this person will do the research related to the uh, society might be uh, associated with ngo going here and there and doing the research that is a combination 48 this also shows that your mother could be mentally disturbed because this is 8th house malefic influence what kind of problem mentally disturbed this is also for mother if you look at from the mother forget about your child from mother this is the first child and don't look at first child because child you can see if you are the first child you know that okay i am the lagna but the progeny you can see what happened the time of progeny with your mother like what what sorts of issues were there and these are not to predict these are to validate the chart when you are looking the chart one or two things you look at whether this chart is there in time difference that i need to rectify and all this is good for property rahu venus venus gets a directional strength if it is forming connection with ketu apartment if it is forming ketu with rahu beautiful big house white color house if it is venus for example person will like that big vehicle all that combination but the problem is also disease and all that this also shows the purity of heart if eighth lord is going and not getting afflicted it means it's inviting that person to get into occult and research all those things and then go towards the moksha how beautiful it is the lord is going and inviting you this is others money where are you in investing others money oh you are investing others money because at the end of the day lagna has to enjoy that where are you investing in property now you are coming back eighth lord eighth house condition is good it means that the whatever that you invested back no problem you are enjoying malefic influence sorry you cannot enjoy your house and all that property you will have many property but still you will live in a rented house if somebody is asking where will i live you need to see Eighth Lord afflicted in fourth house. Sorry, you won't be able to at be at home. What does it mean? I always say eighth Lord. Eighth Lord is unsettlement. Like you are not settled. In that case, look at the twelfth. Is there any connection that is which is getting formed? Try in any how at that's there. Then you look at oh somebody is like the person is traveling abroad. What is the purpose? It is higher education or something else. Then you predict around that. if it is higher education where that money is coming is is it from family is it from uh, sex you keep on connecting and one lord you can predict i don't know n number of things you got to see eight lord sitting in the fourth house and you have to start forming connection and say this is going to happen this is going to happen in this mahadasha antardasha and anything bad you need to provide remedy this is also house of throne all of a sudden you get that throne you know people especially the politicians and all that whether that throne you will be able to sustain gaddi or not that will see from the next house but right now it's giving the indication very clearly that lord has gone there all of a sudden if not uh, malefic influence then you will have access to that throne you'll get that position this is also in front of 10th house and house of happiness eighth lord will decide whether you are going to be happy at home or not if it is afflicted will give you disease and all sorts of problems in your life if not 
you will be digging deeper, looking inside, because Ketu is looking inside inward. You will do really good in research, you will do, do really good in occult sciences, because it's in trine, easy to take it back, at least house placement wise. Some Graha is aspecting and uh, blocking it, that's a different matter. But this is 8th Lord into 4th house. 8th Lord into 5th house. I talked about, if you look at that, uh, uh, just 4th house, I talked about the house of throne. This is house of followers. Sudden followers. You know, if it is forming connection with Rahu, uh, Sun, Mercury, all that social media combination, get into. All of a sudden, in few days, you will have so many followers. And especially followers, I always say you know, you need moon because mind is something that will make sure that people are getting connected and they feel connected with you and they are they started following you. Generally, five and eight combination they look for share market people. Ah, share market now this is good combination. Not necessarily. You need to see because eighth lord has gone to access house of Purva Punya. What you have done, good or bad, in the past. If it is good, then from there, if you look at house of happiness is 8th house, Lord will be very happy to take it back. If not, then don't uh, invest into share market. This also shows that you can get stomach issues and all that. This is markage for your mother. Dasha transit, if it is malefic influence is there, you need to take care of your mother. And what happened with uh, first child, when it was in Lagna, same with your father. You can see that, okay, he'll have thigh issues, issues in thighs and all that. Because also this is son's house, so bones and everything. This is a good combination for sudden gain, sudden wealth, sudden name and fame. Opposite, this is also very bad. Because suddenness is either very good or either bad. I always say Rahu and Ketu, they are really good at giving sudden events. Could be really good or could be really bad. It's not like always bad or always good, no. Depending on malefic influence. This is also yours for your first child, your first child. Now, eighth lord. Eighth lord is others money. Okay. From where it is ac uh, I am getting access, like you are accessing uh, others money. There are parents, those who are dependent on their first child, for example. For them, others money is nothing but the first child money. They are living on that. This is also good at giving you promotions and all that all of a sudden. Why promotion from 10th house? This is 8th place, new beginning. It means you are going to start a new job. Both has good relationship and there is a good relationship with the 8th house. No malefic influence. You can say you will get promoted, you will get better salary, hike. Now source of income so has to be on a monthly basis. It means there should be some connection with the 11th house. Or all of a sudden is bonus and all those things. Oh, the Sa transit is coming, you will get good bonus this year. You looked at that, what is the transit is going on. This is 8th Lord into 5th house. 8th Lord in 6th house, this is Vipreet Raj Yoga. Oh my God, this is Vipreet Raj Yoga, ultimate good. Raj Yoga is nothing but compromise, sacrifice. You work for the people. Yes, this is good. I have, I have given this technique in one of the videos. That if Venus is participating in this Raj Yoga, there could some there could be something hap, uh, something can happen at your in-laws place either someone can die or uh, get uh, influenced by black magic or something like that in that case from there uh, there onwards you will start rising number one number two when i say black magic none of the people they asked me this question sixth house is the house which shows the black magic if it is forming connection with the ninth and eighth what is that whether you will do it or someone else will do it, whether you believe it or not, that you can figure it out with the combination conjunction of 9th and 6th. This is house of longevity. This is house of disease. Afflicted, it will give you the disease which will impact your longevity like anything. Two or more malefic aspecting this or sitting together, make sure you start calculating the longevity. Get into that so that you should provide right uh, remedies. In house which is in between these two is your house which is two things one is the maraka sthana one is your relationship eighth house is the sustenance sixth house is the separation 
now you can say the the person the planet which was responsible to give you the sustenance is participating in giving the separation if there is a connection with the sixth lord also so the planet which was uh, responsible for sustenance now the same planet is giving you separation you need to do remedies for that it's not like you will do it for eighth lord no you need to sorry sixth lord you need to understand who is going and participating this is your house of business your business is not flour uh, flourishing why because 6 8 it looks like vipreet raj yoga but because of the malefic influence it can get into the pap kartari if both side one is eighth lord is anyhow gone there sixth lord is let's suppose gone to eighth or some other malefic sitting in the eighth house all those combination can show that okay it's hard for this person to do good in uh, business this major transformation can come after disease many a times you must have seen people are smoking drinking eating some some uh, tamasic food and all after that once they get the disease they are so transformed that is vipreet raj yoga they are transformed new person that's a new beginning of uh, for that particular person so this is how they will uh, um, uh, transform in laws and this is your prarabdha there is a connection now i always say sixth house is there any moon connection and all that be prepared there will be setbacks in your life emotional setbacks and if in laws are there moon is also there you can know you know that okay it's going to be related to in laws you are going to get emotional setbacks and all that so disease you are it's not only your disease you can see mother's third house shoulder and all that your father's 10th house knee and everything this is longevity for your elder this is the fourth house from your younger so this is heart disease this is longevity the anus hip area hip replacement eighth lord into sixth house malefic influence dasha came transit came you are thinking about yourself your elder sibling is in hospital going for the hip surgery obviously when you say hip surgery the the bones and all you need to make sure that ketu is there for surgery mars is there sun is there all those there is connection conjunction aspect exchange and all that this is how you look at the result of the lord into different houses this is eighth lord into sixth house so guys i hope you guys would have enjoyed the video learned about eighth lord into fourth fifth and sixth house uh, this is all for today we'll again connect tomorrow uh, with seventh eighth and ninth house placement of eighth lord and its result thank you thank you very much नमस्कार